Hi everybody, David Dilling from Markswear. Today's quick tip in Flight Check, the standalone pre-flight application for the Macintosh. Ready to drop this InDesign file onto Flight Check and see what it tells us. Flight Check will scan more than 50 file formats, Illustrator, InDesign, <coughs> Photoshop, Quark Express, and give you a full report. The first screen just for review is a plain English language overview of the potential problems and what they might be. We see some useful information. Picture box off page. In the main screen, or the main overview, we can drill into all different areas, colors, fonts, images, etc. So today's tip has to do with images which use other elements inside of them. For instance, here we see a logo in PDF format. You'll see in this column here, there's, an, there's a little icon. What does that mean? And you can sort by different things. If you hover your mouse over that icon, you'll see it'll tell you which fonts are used inside of that image, or PDF in this case, which is acting as an image. Okay, so I've made many changes to this file here just to give you an example. I'm going to drop it on Flight Check. I've added a bunch of other uh, files with embedded fonts. I'll sort here, and now uh, we'll see this one here is added. And we see Georgia Bold is used. And once again, you'll see up here in the font section, I can now see Georgia Bold. You see right where it is. But these fonts, we don't have them. That's why it's red. So you see they're red because we don't have these fonts on our system. But if we want to edit this file in a PDF editor, we'll need those fonts if we're going to make textual changes to that lo the PDF logo here. Because you see, we don't have them loaded. This one in the WYSIWYG EPS, this font here, Georgia Bold, we do have. Flight check and pre-flight and package Adobe Illustrator files as well. <coughs> Photoshop too. All right. And what we see is we have another file, and we see that it's using all of those fonts in there. Look at them all. So very handy to know which fonts are used where. As you can see, this file uses a lot of fonts in general. And we can see a lot of specifics about fonts as well. It's also nice. You can also get an image preview with many images as well. Very useful. You notice we have a lot of details on color mode, resolution, a lot of great details on your image, including the EPSF where the fonts are used within but not converted to outline, which we have another video on, on on how to convert fonts to outline, which many of you know, but for those who don't, you can maybe check that out. Also, you'll see these are Photoshop documents, and if I make this bigger I can see the, the .psd files here. So you get a lot of valuable information. This is just a quick tip. How to see images which are using other elements inside fonts or even if other images or graphics are placed inside of the image we see that as well. Markster's Flight Check version 6.90 is available for Macintosh and once again we'll check more than 50 file formats and you can download a demo version and try for yourself. www.marksware.com forward slash products forward slash flight check. Thank you. David Dilling from Marksware, wishing you a fantastic day.